In this proposition, we're going to construct a parallelogram equal to a given figure and with a given angle. And um, so the first thing that we're going to do with the figure is split it into two triangles, which I've labeled one and two, to make things a little bit easier to see what we're doing. In step one, we'll take the first triangle and we'll make a parallelogram equal to it, which we're able to do from proposition 42. And then we'll also make sure that the bottom angle here, K, HKF, is equal to the given angle E to meet the requirements of the given. Um, and then next we're going to take triangle two and we're going to create a parallelogram equal to it, um, connected to the parallelogram that we made before. And again, keeping the bottom angle here equal to the given angle, angle E. So now we know that angle HKF is equal to GHM because we made them both equal to angle E, so they're equal to the same thing and equal to each other. Next, we'll note that um, FKH plus KHG is equal to two right angles. We know this because they are parallelograms, two angles inside of the parallelogram. And for the same reason, we know that KHG plus GHM is equal to two right angles. And um, for this reason, now we can say that KHM is in a straight line. It looks that way, but we needed to logically prove it. And we're able to do that by showing that the angles interior add up to two right angles. And so now we'll um, prove that the top line is also in a straight line um, by showing that MGH is equal to HGF and that MHG plus HGL equals HGF plus HGL. And again, we can see that um, we've shown these angles are equal to each other and then we're adding the same thing to each one. And HGF plus HGL is equal to two right angles using the same logic that we used in step four. Now we know that the top of the parallelogram, FGL, is in a straight line. And because we made them parallelograms, we know that FK is parallel to HG, and that HG is parallel to ML, and that KF is parallel to ML. And therefore, we've done what we set out to do and created a parallelogram equal to a given figure.